The concept of shared societies was developed by the Club de Madrid to inspire commitment to a notion of society. A society where all individuals and constituent groups hold equal status, free to express their differences while integrating their voices into the broader population. It is a society centered on respect for the dignity of the individual and his or her community, no matter how different they may seem. Put the prospect of identity politics in the past and to put the problem and the opportunity of identity front and center. We share the conviction that we're in a world increasingly diverse and conscious of social and political inequalities. The question of how we live together and how we manage our differences is one of the most important conversations of our time. We in the Club de Madrid are very grateful to Alan Slivka Foundation for general donations which helped us to develop the Shared Societies project. The biggest contribution we've made is that the term Shared Society is now widely recognized and widely used by other people. The Club de Madrid has a particular advantage because it's a non-political body um, that has huge convening power. So it can bring people who have been in power, it can bring experts, on the same table in a non-threatening environment. The concept of society is inclusive, passes through what for me means a society open, a society culturally disposed to receive different mentalities, different people coming from a background totally different to our, valga la redundancia. To create a world that is prosperous for everybody, to create a world in which <laughs> prosperity is combined with environmental sustainability and to create a world in which we're working together to accomplish this.